Hey everybody, Zeo Lightning returns with Let's Play Magical Quest starring Mickey Mouse for the Super Nintendo. And this is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. In this part, we will be going to the next stage. That's a lot of climbing we're going to be doing. So welcome everyone to stage 4, Pete's Peak. Let's get moving. Hey, it's Goofy. Gorsh, Mickey. I still can't find Pluto. And I've looked everywhere which way but up. Hey, maybe you should look up this mountain. You can even use these snazzy climbing britches and this rope. <laughs> Yuck! Looks like you're gonna need all that help you're, you can get. Alright, so we're going to get the last costume of the game. The climbing gear. Later, Goofy. So with the climbing gear, you can press the, the uh, Y button. Or the, uh, the action button to uh, extend your hook. You can hold up to extend it up. And you can hold forward to launch it forward. And you can do the same thing with down. You can actually grab stuff like blocks. Or you can grab these things. You can pull the shield off this guy, and that's the only way to damage him. And you can hook on to ledges. Only certain ledges work, but you can hook on to them. If you hook straight up, you'll stand still. But if you hook like this, from an angle, you'll actually swing. You can lower yourself or uh, hold yourself, but if you hold left or right, you'll actually jump in that direction. So let's get these coins, because we're going to need them. Just gonna ignore that guy. There we go. You can also use it to stun enemies. It doesn't actually kill them, it just stuns them. You can pick them up from a distance too. You can also activate golden blocks from a distance. And down here, we wanna go in here and get something. Alright, so in the shop. <clears throat> we can finally get the power up for the uh the uh the, um, firefighter outfit and now we've gained all major power ups in the game. We just have a couple more uh things left to get. Also it spawns us right next to the uh right next to the shop, so if you want to go back in there you can. But anyway, we're gonna go up here. Take that shield off that guy so we can beat him. Now you're gonna have to be careful because you're gonna have to be doing some tricky, tricky platforming from this point onward. Ugh, shit. I was a bit off there. Wow, okay. Alright, third time's the charm. There we go. You have to be very precise. So much food here. Be careful of these gusts. Now that we're really high, if you get carried by those gusts of wind, they'll carry you down and it's an instant kill. It will kill you automatically. So you do not want to get caught in those gusts of winds. Alright. There we go. Oh, and I... Kind of lucky here. That I fucked that up. But there's actually another secret here. Alright, now this is very difficult. I'd only advise this if you're really good at this game. 
which I'm not. What you have to do is you have to hang on the edges of this platform over here. This is going to drain your lives, honestly, if you try this. I'm only doing it for 100%. It's not worth it, honestly. Here you'll find some money, but that's not what's worth it here. Uh, okay. We get another health extension, and that's always nice. There's only uh, one more left in the game because there's no because for some reason you can only get uh, nine hearts in this game, not ten. I don't know why. All right. There we go. This is not easy, by the way. By no stretch of the mind is this easy. And we make our way over here. Whew. Alright. Anyway, it's boss time. Make sure when you're holding on to this when the boss starts because it can blow you off. You want to get the eggs, hang back on here. Sometimes the boss doesn't immediately uh, come uh, wave, but it's good to be on here just in case. If you still hear the flapping, that's a pretty good indicator that he's still going to be uh, staying down. But it's a pretty easy boss nonetheless. You can only grab the eggs uh, with, the, um, with the climbing gear. And if you use the eggs on him, that's more f that's uh, that does the most damage than like using the magic or anything. But he can blow you off the stage while he's swooping by, so you have to be careful. Anyway, that's it for gonna be it for this part. In the next part, we're gonna be taking on the next stage. So this is Zeo Lightning over and out. Catch you later, peeps.